Brazzer man. Yes. Hello. We need more build there. Hello, I am pink. Something you doing? Um, it's good that I never forget to switch the overlay. Oh my god, he's purple. Alright. I'm gonna switch. Pink and purple. Yes. Something you doing? Pink and purple is a bit too much. I'll switch to blue and red. isn't 100 milliseconds you see because 100 milliseconds is the built-in ping guiler qc and then there is my ping to united states west server which is generally around 180 and so that's 280 ping for me effectively if i compare it to versus ai locally which is zero milliseconds i have 280 milliseconds extra against a legit opponent now guys uh, from what I know this guy always goes far seer as well Razorman he's from Croatia I think I played back against him back in the day Legitimate question, I, I don't know anyone's level. I thank you. The past is the future is meow. Yes, what do you want? Destiny Attack. My eyes are open. Yes. We're under attack! You need my counsel. My eyes are open. Something is doing? You need my counsel. Yes. My eyes are Greetings, open. Greetings, friend. Work complete. Work complete. What do you want? My eyes are open. The past is the future. What? Are you sure about that? That's not how I understand it. I thought everything was pretty linear. And the meow? That just seems way out there. I want to quit my job to clean mirrors for a living. <laughs> okay. It's just something I can see myself doing. Oh, right. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's really good. Wolves of sand. I can see how you're a dad. I think that joke really reflect, reflects on your state of mind. Watch out. Something is doing. Destiny, what you see, something is 
Stop trying to mirror your pants. <laughs> no. That's a wasted effort. Of course I'm going to finish it. That's a better effort. Oh, thank God he has another heal cell. Thank God. Thank you, God, for the heal cell. I don't care if I get my TP lost as long as I in interrupt a number of solves. I think that's how I win this game anyway. Make sure he doesn't have full healing. Distract and protect.
You said it wrong, it's okay, you all get the message. You're already Nanua! GG. This is the type of game where you really want to watch the replay. He's got it. Baby, he's got it. <laughs> Oma wa mo shinderu. You're already dead. <laughs> Let's watch the replay. My first 10v13v1 v ever and probably my only one. <laughs> Let's watch it together peeps. Uh, for sure, thanks for the 10 month sub. And Wolf of Sound for the punny joke. Ready to work. Ready to work. Yay! Wow, our Shinderu. Ready to work. <laughs> Shinderu. Ready to work. Ready to work. Womai Mitsubishi Toyota. Ready to work. All right, let's uh, let's take a look at uh, what happened here, because uh, this was a very interesting game. So he has elected to go for the uh, quick fires here, quick item, into late barracks and second burrow. So this is a very late tech with pretty heavy early game focus. We're 
Uh, I'm gonna keep uh, the vision on him, so he will be the blue one and I'll be red in this particular replay. So let's talk about how much use he gets out of these initial three items that he buys. He's gonna do a creep cam. And he hasn't used any of his items yet. Uh, so far he hasn't lost any peons, but there has been some damage. He still hasn't used items, but keep in mind that he does not need to return home on account of buying his items that soon. Though it has delayed his initial grunt, which could have been used to repel the Feral Spirit harass. Still no peons lost, well done, this is not easy to maintain. He now has lost some resources, he also reached a little bit too early and has now left everything from the tavern, so his, tav his tavern hero is way later than it should have been. Alright, let's see. These are going to be the most impactful uh, Feral Spirits so far, I think. We're under attack. One, two, three, four. Okay. Then we had a big brawl in, in uh, my base, which he pretty much won out in. He also saved many units, and he got a clarity, but I did cancel it. We're under he now has... Six to seven peons in his mine. Six peons in his mine. And another five here. So he's down one peon. Normally you're 40-40. Um, and he's also running low on lumber. We're and he does not currently have enough lumber to make a burrow. So that's nice. I slowed down his attacks. What he did well was killing my beastry. But he also did not have pillage. He did not lose another peon for now on this harass. I got the surround and fires here, made him go back and at this point I knew how important it is to cancel as many units as possible on their heal solve. I got one, two, three, about three. He has six peons and five. Okay, so he still hasn't remade the, that peon that he lost but you don't really need it anymore especially when you have pillage which i don't think he has got a few important cancels on solves he only has one solve left so he has permanent We're damage now attack. in this attack didn't lose any peons here and attacks again yes i think that will add warcraft to the bnet client ray, no ray noodle unban me this was um, a good idea by me, but a bad execution. The idea was hold position all my grunts, stand as one, and make sure he doesn't get to attack them easily. But I did so in a sloppy manner. They're all on hold pause. Ideally, I want to use these burrows in defense. The correct way to do it would be to micromanage each individual unit. One grunt here on hold pause. One here. One here. One here, one here, one here, and shadow there. Hold pause, then when he attacks, Burrows will fire. This was just a lazy execution method of it. And it basically gave him two grunts, not entirely for free, but it did hurt a lot. The first grunt is almost free. These might be the most impactful Feral Spirits. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. So he's got plenty of resources, so he doesn't notice it immediately. He currently is not mining at all. Ready to ride. And he's down to 34 foot, I'm at 36. Had I not done that, and had he saved them better, I, I could have still been in a lot of trouble. He's level 3-2, I'm 3-2 as well. And his raiders give him a lot of micro capabilities. Now we basically won the game at this time. Equal food with healing from shadow. And I have better health on my units. And grunts beat raiders pound for pound. They just get out microed. 
but now that doesn't matter anymore because I'm gonna have enough units. So this was uh, the tipping point, those peons.